Oh, Shay here. It is 10 o'clock in the morning, and that means stores are opening up. So we are going to do a shopping with Shay. I know. It's been a minute, it's been a while, but I've been down and out, as y'all know, and I've not felt like shopping. Not that I do anyways. I'm not a huge lover of shopping, but I do it anyways, because I've got to. And uh, I always have fun with y'all. It does make it better when I do it with you. So y'all are worth it. So what we're gonna do today is, we're gonna go to a store called The Container Store. So for those of you that are not familiar with The Container Store, I've been trying to think about a good way to describe it. And if you love organizing and anything like that, organizing any part of your house, they have what you would need. It's that kind of store. They have totes and buckets and different sizes of you know what's underneath the cabinet, shelving, you, they just have it. It's a cool little store. Um, the reason why I'm coming here today is because not just because I don't really need anything, I'm coming to do a return. But I thought, what a fun opportunity to do a store that I've never done before. And for those of you that might want to see what it looks like inside. So um, I do have some heavy shelves. I've got to lift and carry, which is going to be fun. Um, hopefully it won't be too bad. So I won't be able to like walk y'all in. I figure I'll do them my return first. And then um, I'll start filming and we'll kind of just take a little, whoop, my foot kind of slipped. We'll take a little cruise through the store. Um, I don't know if these are nationwide or if they're all over. I mean, I don't know. I have no idea. So let me know down below if y'all have a container store. Um, if you like it, it's kind of like a Home Depot, like Home Depot's for like hardware and you know, all that stuff. This is like that. So it's not really my cup of tea. I love, I love being organized, but I'm not good at organizing, right? I'm not, I want to be, and I come in the store and I'm like, oh my God, but I can't make a decision on what I like and what I want to get. So, um... Yeah, the, what I have to return today is um, we came here after Christmas because they were having a sale on their shelving. And we have shelves inside the closet, inside the craft room that the 3D printers are on. And originally we were gonna have the shelving going across all the way from one end of the closet to the other, right? You walk and you just see shelves. Well, we started thinking, what if you need to get to the printers, right? And work on them and do things. So we decided to leave that open center, the open part of the closet totally open. Like just, you can walk in the closet now essentially and you can get to the printers on the shelves. So we've got that center um, area just open. Oh my God, this lady's parking really close to my car. Oh, that would really be bad if y'all saw my car get hit. What the heck? No offense, but grandma, I don't know about if grandma should be driving. Grandma is, oh my gosh, she's really close. The good news is the passenger side is what's close to me. So, and I don't think she thinks she's by herself. So she's going to be getting out on the other side, but she got really close to my car parking. Y'all people here. Um, so yes, I need to return the center shelves because we ended up just using the outside. It's really cool because you can walk in the closet, turn, work on the printers, turn, work on the printers, the printers that are on those shelves. And then there's a couple other shelves at the very top that don't have anything. And I was able to put some stuff up there. Yeah. So, Okay. I got my coffee and let me show y'all what the outside of the store looks like. We'll start there. Hold on. Let me take y'all out of the, out of the mount. Okay. So this is what it looks like. Let me see if y'all can see the, it's the container store. It's gonna, let me make sure y'all can see it. I don't want to stop filming. Cause then I, um, can y'all even see? I don't know what y'all can see. Yeah. The container store. There we go. And they have something called, um, alpha shelving which is what we got for the closet and it's 20 percent off right now so that's what we got so yeah let me carry all this heavy ass stuff in and y'all hurt my back last night i've got like a sciatic nerve like pinched nerve so i really don't want to carry these shelves in but i have to and they're like metal they're metal shelves but um do what you gotta do right gotta do what you gotta know all right, I'm going to pause. I'm going to do what I got to do. And then I will walk y'all through the store and see if there's anything cool we can find. Okay. All right. See y'all in a bit. All right. In a bit. It. <laughs> I just put things. See y'all in a bit and see y'all in a minute. See y'all in a minute. All right. Bye. Okay. Success. I got my return done. And now I'm going to show y'all um, some of the store. So, um, gosh, there's so much cool stuff. So let me turn the camera on and I'll show you what so it looks they like. They have, you know, whiteboards and pegboards. 
all kinds of bulletin boards, everything. This is the um, office section. Got all these organizational boards. And even in here, just looking at all the different storage containers, look at all the different sizes they have. Different sizes, colors, everything you can imagine they have here. <laughs> It's crazy. They even have um, a bin collection and it shows you different, you know, ways of organizing it. Wow. And they're kind of like a frosted clear. Yeah, I'll tell you what, if you want to be organized, this is your store. Oh, well, they have some art bin stuff. That's cool. I'm always looking for these for washi tape. I know they make one. Let's see, they have all kinds of little containers here. Kind of reminds me of Harbor Freights, but of course they don't have the removable boxes. Wow, they have so much, y'all. I mean, you can just get so organized here. Wow, they have all the different colored boxes. These are cute. What are these for? Photo storage. Hmm. Who stores their photos in a box? And they have all the little, you know, cases to store, you know, your memorabilia, anything important. Art, hobby, and craft boxes. Those remind me of like caboodles or like a, you know, basically like a fish, like a tackle box. Oh, that's cute. I've seen these before. These little bins that, oh, y'all came to, I'm looking at, that like flip open. The mobile flip flip out bin bins. Those are cool. 10 drawer medium stackable craft organizer. Yeah, they have so much stuff. Oh, what are these? Let's check these out. These are kind of cool. See these little boxes? Oh, they, they, they slide out. It looks like this. Huh, ideal for office crafts and DIY. It's cute. I'm just trying to think what I need. Do I need? I'm not sure what I need, y'all. Okay, so that's this aisle. Oh, it's just aisles and aisles and aisles of this kind of stuff. They have different, they have a kitchen section. They have an office, they have a closet. Um, yeah, they have a lot. They even have like the, you know, for magazines. Wall pockets is what they're called. Let's see what else is over here. This is a bath. So this is for your bathroom. Do have things for like your makeup. Look at all the shower stuff. A shower mirrors. All the little caddies. Yeah, they have a lot. Let's see, this is like makeup organizers. Makeup organizer and storage kit. Who would be that organized with their makeup? Wow. And they have all these little like, almost like for jewelry. Look at these tiny little boxes, y'all. Lipstick organizer. Oh my gosh, 24 section acrylic lipstick riser. Check that out, put your lipsticks in there. Nice, very nice. And they have all these little makeup drawers. They're like leather ones, oh my gosh. And of course they have all the stuff for the counter, you know, the toothbrush holders, Kleenex boxes, all the things. Oh, that's cute, they have like this little, Style divided turntable with removable bins. Oh, that's cool. $30. Yeah, that's the thing. Things here are not cheap. Divided bath tote. That would be cute to do like a gift basket in. Check this out. That's really cute. Divided bath tote. How, what makes it? I guess you have to put the dividers in there. Hmm, it's taped. Oh, that's cute. It's on the turntable. That's cute. How much is that? Probably expensive. I don't even see how much it is. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing about this store. Um, it's pricey. Pricey, pricey. Acrylic silverware caddy. Yeah, it's very nice. Very nice. 
Well, let's see what else we can see, y'all. I wanted to take you into the, um, I wanted to go look in the office section over here because I was curious if they had anything for the craft room. They have all this stuff, you know, markers and stickers and magnets. Cute. Look at the sushi magnets, the donuts. Oh, these are pretty. Diamond magnets. Those are pretty. Baskets, every size imaginable. All the wicker baskets. Here's like um, some of the art carts. You can get three tiered art carts. Oh wow, look in here. Oh how cute, it's like a little toolbox. You'll see that up there? Those are so cute. Oh, they have them in all different colors. I wish they weren't so high. Poppin' three drawer stow, three cat cabinets. Very nice. They have all different colors. Oh, these are so cute. They have all the different file folders you would want, all the different colors. Wow. Yeah, let me see what else they have. They have a. Uh... Yeah, those are so cute. And of course, they have all these. They have. But yeah, they have a pink one. Look, they even have yellow, they have mint green. It's so high though. Yeah, it's like a little, they have little drawers. It's like a little toolbox is what it reminds me of. Those are so cute. Let me see what other colors. And then of course they have, you know, all the different bins, multi-purpose bins. Oh my gosh, so much. The store is overwhelming sometimes. Okay, now let's look at these. I think I can, oh, I like this green one. This, oh no, I kind of like that mint green one better. Yeah, I can't, I need to bring some down here. Cute. They're just little bins. Oh, those are adorable. Oh my gosh. What? $110? Holy guacamole. I told y'all they were expensive. Oh my gosh. And then they have the bigger file cabinets. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Of course, you know, they have like these file folders that hang. That's pretty cool. Okay, what else we got back here? Ooh, 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 ooh. Something for washi tape. Yes. Can y'all see that? Look at all the washi tape right there. So $23 is a three drawer organizer. Let's take a look at this. Oh, that's cute. It's got like a little handle. Yeah, that's cute. See? Put all your supplies in there. Cute. What's this thing? Hmm, okay. I'm gonna put this on the floor for a second so I can take a look at it. I wish I could open up the drawers, but I can't because it's got the, but yeah, they have these little knobs that pull out. So let's see. I guess the washi tape just like lines up. Sorry for the shadow, y'all. Yeah, it looks like it just, washi tape. Ooh. I wish I could kind of open it up, but I can see where it would fit in there nicely. That's cute. I'm gonna take a picture of that and put that on my little wish list. That's a great idea. Oh, oh, that's for ribbon up there. Okay. Wow. I'm telling y'all. Oh, and for shoes, for shoe organization, it's crazy the stuff they have here. Like to have these whole systems. All these different walls you can like hook hook different things on. The store's pretty empty. Oh, uh, this is more for like garage. Yeah, this is for garage storage. All these shelves. A little bag for your balls. Cool. Yeah, this is like the work surface we got for um, the 3D printers. It's the shorter shelves, the smaller ones. But yeah, look at all this. All the wire racks. More baskets. What do y'all think of the store? It's pretty sweet, right? Okay, so that's the garage. Then they have, let's see, shelving, garage, office. And then, um, wow. Yeah, look at all the bins. Just, I mean, anything you want, any size. What do we got in here, office stuff? Oh yeah, this stuff's cute in here. Bookshelves. They even have a circuit, travel. 
Oh, this is all the cute little stuff. Looks like they're stocking up. Oh my gosh, look at these. Eraser set, little macaroons. They've got all kinds of, mo you know, weekly planners. Cute stuff. And of course, every color imaginable for any kind of desks, you know. Oh, look at all these bins. Connecting book bin. Okay. What's coming on this out? Yeah, these are photo boxes. What do we got here? Pencil boxes. Wow. Y'all, this store is so much. What do we got here? A desk pad. But it's not like my Ikea one. I love my Ikea one, y'all. You know I do. This one's just like a rubber mat. I like my magnetic one. But yeah, look at all the cable management. All the different cords. Oh my gosh. Different stands for like your computer. Wow. It's cute. That pink. It's like a rose gold almost. What do we got back here? Ooh. More stuff, 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 stuff. Office. Oh yeah, it looks like they're uh, stocking. Cause I've never seen it look like this before. So a little um, information about this store. The Container Store is always ranked one of the top, I think it's 50 companies to work for. Um, or it might even be top 25, but I think it's top 50. <clears throat> but um, I always see the same people working here. It's in a very, very helpful here. That's $40 for this. It's plastic. Acrylic, acrylic tape block. Wow. Look at these scissors. Those are fancy. It's all the acrylic stuff. Wow. All right. It looks like they're they've gotten in some new stuff. Maybe they're getting rid of all their they just got rid of all their Christmas stuff. Oh, look at these bags. And of course they have um they have gift wrap back here. You know, that's why I said we come here and get like you know Christmas paper. Oh look at all this stuff. Look at all the colors. The wall cups. And all the colored bins back here. Yeah, here there's all the birthday stuff. They have gift bags. Lots of cute paper. This looks like the kids section back here. Yep, playful storage. So yeah, for a kids room. If you need baskets or bins. Oh, so cute. Oh, look at all the colors. They even have, block they even have boxes for like your Legos back there. For your kids books, for like their hampers. Oh, those are cute. I love these little pink ones. Look at these. They're like a baby's room, like a nursery. Oh, look at them all. Like a big toy box. It's cute. They have all these wire baskets here. Green. Wow. These are cute too for toys. A rolling storage bin with lid. That's cute. Luke could use one of those. Oh, here's the uh, clearance section back here. So it's good to see what they have. I don't see anything. They even have boxes, tape, bubble wrap. Yes. What else we got down here? I think this is gonna get into the kitchen stuff down here. So this is gift packaging. And then they have travel. They have a foot locker. Wow. All kinds of they have trash cans galore here's all your travel toiletry stuff we actually got the kids um because whenever we travel we always keep all their chargers and everything with us and we're like the boys need to start you know holding keeping their own chargers and all their own stuff for their devices and we got them mm, a bag here i don't see it now but a little bag here to put all their chargers and stuff in <clears throat> we got three of them so each of the kids have their own little bags. Let's see what's, oh, they got neck pillows, of course. Ooh, knapsack. This one looks pretty comfy. It's like a little, is it a blanket? Oh, it's a blanket and a pillow. Very cool. Oh, that's cute. Little luggage tags. 
Okay. So yeah, this store's a poncho pouch. Poncho in a pouch. All right. Oh, they even have those little um, luggage racks that you, you know, open up and put your bags on, like they have at hotels. Wow. Yeah, here's all the um, trash cans. Look how many trash cans they have. Any kind of trash can, different size of trash can, like little ones, big ones. Look at this tiny little one. That's cute. Yeah, they have a lot of trash cans. Mops, buckets. Let's see what else they have. Oh, they have pet food stuff. They have pet stuff too. Look at these food bins. These are cute. To put your dog food in or your cat food. Cute. We have one of these bins, but it's just clear. Yeah, cute. I'm gonna have these too. Yeah, we just have like one of these type of things to put our dog food in. Let's see. Oh, laundry baskets. Wow. Y'all see what I mean? This store is crazy. And they have, of course, all the pet stuff like for treats, bowls, little toy baskets. Oh my gosh, so cute. They have a, here's all the, all the cleaning stuff. Got ladders, all different little stools. More containers. Containers galore. So here's kitchen. So of course they got, you know, all the kitchen stuff along this whole wall. Get your kitchen organized. Yeah, all the racks that you can put in your pantry or underneath the kitchen sink. This store is overwhelming to me. I mean, look at this. Wow. All the different sizes you could want for storage, for food storage. All right, what's in here? More stuff. More, 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 more. Here's all the cute little cool things. Oh yeah, Bev was asking about the scrub mommy. So she was talking about the scrub daddy in her um, live on Tuesday night. This is a scrub daddy. The only difference is he's yellow and she's pink. I don't know if she's got a bow. Uh, I can't remember, but I have one at home. But they're the same price. It's just a cute pink one instead of a, but these are great for if you know need a sponge. What's this one? Dye free? Oh, well, they have a white one. Scratch free. It's America's favorite sponge. Yes, these scrub daddies are great. So if you want to grab one of these, I would definitely recommend it. Lou has gotten um, paint on the table before, and I've just used that, get it wet. It scrubs everything off. Oh, Matt, that's what we need. We need a new brush for the kitchen sink. Actually, we need a whole new, like, little contain, like, little, you know, um, holder. But what's our brush look like? I like the brush we have. It's got the soap dispenser. So you push the little button. All right, this one. Let's see, $14.99. See, it's got the button right here. And you just you twist off the top right here and you fill it up with soap and then you just push the button when you're doing the dishes and it comes out. Nice, I'm gonna grab this one. See, I did need something from here. Is this one the same? Hmm, what's the difference? I guess this is like, you know, stainless steel. This one's just white like a black plastic. Doesn't have a price on it. The ring. What's that do? Man, there's all kinds of brushes. Okay, what else we got? More bins. Lots and lots of bins. All kinds of the contact paper, like shelf liners. Ice cubes. Ice packs. Little lunch bags. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh, there's so much. It's a lot. And then, of course, baby stuff more food storage. Wow. Okay, I see an employee, so I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> Just in case. I am looking for a holder. Oh, here we go. I passed them right here. To store our, um, our brush, like in the sink. What is this one do? Stainless steel sink caddy. Let me see if I like this one. This one's kind of big. 
um what's the deal with the bottom i guess that catches where it catches the water stainless steel sink caddy so we could have our brush in there and our scrub daddy it's got the different dividers in there to put your stuff okay it's twenty dollars though yeah that's the thing about the store things are not cheap what else do they got okay we do need a new one let's test it out let's see if it Sorry, y'all got you zoomed in. Let me zoom you out a little bit. I had y'all zoomed in quite a bit, I'm sorry. Let's see, will this fit in here? Well, I guess it won't fit in here when it's, here we go. Yeah, so I just stick it right in there like that. And you can put a sponge in there. Okay, I'm gonna get these two things. Yay. Yeah, I feel bad, I've had y'all zoomed in really, really close. So I've got all kinds of uh, turntables, like Lazy Susans. More baskets and baskets and baskets and more baskets. Oh, the shelves for like um, spices and stuff so you can see what you've got. It's down here. We've got labels here. Spice racks. All right, y'all. I've shown you the majority of the store without getting in trouble. If there was employees, I kind of like dodged that area. But yeah, I'm going to get this. And then I'm gonna think about that washi tape um, holder. I'm gonna think about that. Okay, um, I'll show y'all, um, if I see anything else, I'll head out to the car and I'll see y'all then. Let me see if there's anything else to show you out here. And they just have like all kinds of cool little, you know, things by the register. Oh, there was something I did see I wanted to show y'all. So whenever we give our dogs a bath, they're really bad about, you know, um, you know, staying in the bathtub and they had a lick lick mat it's called a lick lick mat and you put like paste or something on it and it keeps the dog licking and it keeps them distracted oh they have a screen daddy Bev, check this out screen daddy clean your screen how cute is that it's like these little microfiber cleaning pads i have never seen those see they have this kind of stuff there cotton buds They've got cool stuff here, y'all. They really do. But let me show you the little lick lick pad. I thought it was so funny. Let me see where it's at. I think it was over here. Oh, sitting pretty. Toilet seat covers. <laughs> That's funny. And of course they have they have the poopery. But yeah, check out these little lick lick pads. Check, check them out. Oops, I dropped it. Let me grab this one. Peanut butter goes here. Oh, you put peanut butter on there. But look at that. Make washing and grooming easy and fun. And a suction cup on there. Oh my gosh, I kind of want to get one. Because Margo will not stay in the bath. She jumps up on the side all, all every time. They're 10 bucks. Hmm. I thought this was also cute too. This um, dog treat selfie clip. So to get a good picture of your dog, you just hang it from the, fits all phones, and you put a treat up on top over your phone. <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all, they have the funniest stuff here. All right, I'm at the register, and I'm going to go ahead and check out, and I'll see you on the car. All right, bye. Okay, I made it back into the car. Um, yeah, that was fun. I hope y'all had a good time. The store wasn't that busy because it's, you know, during the week and they just opened, I think at 10. Um, but I got, I'm getting a little hot now from walking around that store. It was cold this morning, but I think I'm going to take my jacket off. So y'all let me know how you're doing below. Like I said, I haven't done a shopping with Shane in a long time and y'all just make it so much better being able to walk through a store with somebody. I think that's part of the problem why I don't like shopping is because I'm always by myself and it's not, oh my gosh, this braid y'all, my hair is still straight and it's like all the little ends are like falling out. I'm used to it being curly and it just stays, but I don't know, I guess you have to redo it. All right, I'm hot. I'm getting like sweaty pits. Are my pits actually sweaty? I don't know if y'all can see wet pits, that'd be embarrassing. Oh my gosh, I'm actually sweating. <laughs> that's embarrassing i might edit that out or i might leave it, leave it in why not right everybody sweats okay i need my hand sanitizer so y'all i spent 60 something dollars in there but i got back like 
200 and something dollars by returning those shelves. So that was good. So I actually didn't spend anything if I look at it that way. I returned some stuff and then I bought, you know, what I showed y'all. I didn't find anything else. I pretty much took y'all um, until the very end. But let's see, that scrub brush was, how much was the scrub brush? Oh, the brush was $14.99 and the little sink caddy was $20.99. And then the little wall clips I needed for the closet were, I got three of them and they were $7.20 each. So yeah, I'm kind of excited about this. Drip tray drains excess water through easy pour spout. Oh, it's like a little spout right there. I didn't see that before. Removable divider separates cleaning tools for quick drying. Very cool. Here, let's get into it. Now that I bought it. Okay. So that's pretty cool. Look at that. So it's got the big, and our brush fits in there really good. And then again, you know, if you get water down there from everything draining, you can just like drain it out like this. You don't even have to open it. And then I can put uh, my scrub daddy or put some, you know, um, sponges right there. Yay. And a need toy for the kitchen. Okay. Nice. All right, I wish I brought some water with me. I'm parched. Shopping always makes me parched. It's uh, 41 degrees out is what my car is saying, but it feels so much warmer to me. I need my sunglasses. Oh, I left my sunglasses in the back. Oh, well, when I was unloading the stuff to return, I took them off and I put them in my back trunk. So my glasses are way back there. So now I have to go to the grocery store and I won't take y'all there because that's boring. Um, I do have plans to do my next shopping with Shay. This one was kind of a, uh, had to do a return. So I was like, uh, I'll do one there, but I have some other plans at some really cool stores that we're gonna go to just specifically, speci I have a hard time saying that word, specifically for shopping with Shay videos. So those will be coming um, soon. I've just been trying to get my strength back up, trying to get my mojo back. Um, I'm feeling about 90, I'd say about 95%. I would say 95.5 maybe, but I'm getting there. I am definitely getting there, y'all. I'm getting better every day. I can breathe more. Um, I've been walking to pick up Lou from school and then we've been walking home and that's been good exercise for me. Um, I hurt my back a little bit yesterday bending over. I have a like a pinched nerve in my back that acts up sometimes if there's tension or muscle tension and I guess I did something. So I was bending over yesterday doing a lot of product reviews for Craftably and I was bending over and looking at ABs and filming and looking at, you know, looking through my phone and I did several of them and I think I hurt my back bending over. Maybe that had something to do with it. I don't know. There's Ikea. Hi, Ikea. No, well, the store we were just at, the container store, that's like the upper echelon of like Ikea, right? Because Ikea has all that same stuff, but the container store is like high dollar it's expensive in there but they have some really nice stuff um i just sometimes don't know what i need you know if i had um if i had like hired like a organizer you know person that did that for a living and you know hired them to come into my kitchen or my craft room whatever and organize things for me that would be awesome to go in there with them like that and they're like okay i think this 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 and we'll get you set up that's what i need is like a personal shopper I don't know what I need. All right, I'm gonna stop at the grocery store, get some stuff for dinner. Gotta get some tortillas for uh, taco night. And um, I hope y'all enjoy that. I know it was just one store, but we're we gotta get back into the swing of things. I've already been to the post office uh, this morning and I've already been to the UPS store. So I, I can only do so much until I start to go, ooh, I'm gonna have to lay down after this and take a nap. Um, we'll see. But I definitely wanted to get a shopping with Shay video out to y'all because I love doing them. And uh, that store is something different than I don't, and I don't go there very often. So yeah, and if you like the container store, they have a website, of course. Um, so you can always go check out their website and if there's anything you need or go check out your local one, if you haven't already, they're awesome. It's amazing. If you like to organize, that's your store. Yes, if you like little bins and little, little, little things, you know. All right, you guys. Um, I guess until next time, uh, let me see what else I got going on this week. Um, I have my whipping chat coming out. 
and I have an unboxing coming up. So y'all will see some of those things, okay? And of course I have my live on Sunday, so be sure and come to my live if you can. It's four to five uh, Central Standard Time. All right, okay, you guys love you and uh, take care. I'll see you soon. Okay, bye guys.